the non-stereo version. And we have a no operation shader, which is doing nothing. So that's the input image. But the purpose of showing the input image is that we can zoom in and zoom out and see how it looks. And if we zoom in, we can look around the image. And we see that all those micro images, okay, all those micro images are square which is unnatural. That's because I put a square aperture in the main camera lens. I open the lens and put square aperture. So they fit together without black spaces. Usually the micro image is a circle because the aperture is a circle. And then you see the picture is upside down. <coughs> and there are many views of the same object. And for those who can cross their eyes and see stereo with crossed eyes, you, you will see this is just stereo. But it's not two view stereo like a normal camera, but it is about 25 or 50 views or something of that order. So that's again the image. And if we go to the our rendering, that's the final picture that we get. And we are free to focus and <coughs> some, some say that we are refocusing the image. We are not refocusing because there was no image captured originally. It was a <coughs> single, uh, one single image form. We are focusing the image. We are not only focusing, but we are constructing the image computationally in the camera. Now we are focused on the three branches. And now we are focused on the girl in front. And now we are focused on the beehives at the background. <coughs> 